oh my goodness, I'm eating shit. Hello my sugar binga bungas, welcome back to my channel, yeah. uh, welcome back to Umsam Wami, the show that is a must, the show that you can trust, and the show that never, ever attracts dust. <laughs> I've been watching a whole lot of swool lately, it's gotten me through shite. Shout out to Michael Dapai, Dapang and Bell. I depend on as we born in Kuns Malangam too. Please be sure to support him. Be sure to subscribe to his channel. He is the real MVP. He is the shite. Speaking of shite, ah, again, it's in Jay. He got caramba, lozi, missing Kunza. Oh, he got caramba. He got caramba, lozi, missing Kunza. Oh, he got caramba. Boom, boom, boom. How? I bang. Isn't it sense and give me low more? Bo killings. I am not a slowly man. I am not a slowly man. I. I am in brief. So, there's a video that's going around, that's doing the rounds, that's quite viral at the Mo or over social media. Kwenzagalani, I'm too. I'm too. Gitsen, I'm changing this representa leo team. That's why I decided to wear something. Eta izenze sakakapan. Eelale kokaka brown. Because do excuse my French, we're grown folk, okay? And isn't isn't Zagala So we need to talk about such things. Such conversations need to be had because these are real things that affect real people. They've been happening for quite some time and they continue to happen. Therefore, I'm someone Sikuluma Makini so siwa beka nge mbaba. Here we leave no stone unturned, darling. So basically Guleo Vito, what's happening is there is a young beautiful lady who happens to be in Dubai. Dubai, Dubai, I asambain. See Dubai 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 Dubai, Dubai. Hey, mangas and get Dubai. But these things do not only happen in Dubai, guys. Ting nenzenibe washke me nagi. Let me put you on game. They happen all over the world. And it's not just our people who partake in such activities, it is every kind of person. Yizo zonke in obo, yizo zonke is where every racial group you could possibly think of partakes in such acts. And I absolutely hate how you classify these women as ama slay queens because sin diminisha lilika hamamanj. A slay queen is a beautiful lady who takes care of herself. I mean, that is how the term came to be. And I absolutely hate, I loathe, I despise how whenever a woman succeeds, it is always questioned. Whenever a woman progresses in life, to high man, Jaini. Showcase no sugar dead. Showcase she cut corners. Surely she slept with someone to get to that particular position. Surely that they nega a petula a sandoza in order to elevate to the next level. This doesn't apply to every woman, and unfortunately, unfortunately, kuna bantu beskazani abatikulela pansi ikamale chai suga matota. So in that video, there's a beautiful young woman who has her mouth wide open. <laughs> and right above her, an entire 
anus. A grown man's booty, booty is seated on top of a porter potty, which is basically a portable toilet. It is so tiny and so portable to a point where, like, you could see the feces. We are born amagaga penetrating the seat and entering into the lady's mouth. This young lady's mouth is basically being defecated into. She is devouring feces. Ula amagaga. Umamfuza amachimba. Bamfuka i dede lo tuvi. Ingo bonje, uksecura i bag. It's all about money. It's all about securing the bag. And sex traveling is a thing, guys. Sex traveling is a thing. This is when people travel to different parts of the world to have sex with different people for different reasons. But in most cases, it's to secure the bag or to provide the bag in the case of these rich men who partake in such acts. So we have multiple role players at play when it comes to such things. We have these blessers or these rich, wealthy men, and they're not just Arab men, but iningi yebo. Kota nje inde nza galayole, mshaben wonge chigele, ninga ikosis, ninga zenzi ngon. Enda ksitina sotwa, eskwenza ayoloku. Ay, onze bez kanyelanga. Ay, bamanja, bamanja kakulu, it's the norm for them. It is the norm, at least in a suburb of Utaibo. Jani Utaganjani um hata o Umunyanganjani um hoto, one muto pilayo. We shall not all as one, we shall not all as Uta one. Amagaganja, Magag, if the name. O Mundo get opilayo, on in Mondo, a sebenzayo, or Sandayo. How do you even go about doing such? I but in Dan Zagalai. I o Geloba Manj. Just think of the bag. It'll be over in no time and you'll be living your best life in no time. So why not? Why not work? It is so crazy to me how people have normalized amashazo. And yes, I know these things have been going on before we even existed. Yeah, but oh, koko betu imbala mabenzi zindo e shaka isi kazi e chasmuli sum zimba kote zai fikagele goba baba zuguti ichazo. They did it in secret because they knew how shameful those acts were. Nowadays, you guys are normalizing nonsense, rubbish. Ni kwaha zenge, ni kwaha zenga makoks, ni bijos, sapa sapa, ni shuta ni nei tombe, ni benga ting, ni right, ni benga tabanda ba pila, ni makanda, ni benga nzizi zenge, na zana mumu, na zana spoka. You guys are perpetuating the stigma. So what's it, Tina? We are gold diggers. We are lazy. We want to leech off of hardworking men. We are parasites. We are unworthy of love and respect. I'm a daughter, na bante msabin wonke nje chigelele, ma bebuga le lishazo. They lose faith in us. Zitini ngane. Yeah, but you didn't sign up to be anyone's role model, but zitini ngane. Because ekone ni ziakbuk. Zibuge la gwe na futi. Especially mo hambuz dwali sabo social media. Whether we like it or not, or whether we choose to believe it or not, in ngane ziazbona, zonke le zint. Ui tengeli phone, ui tengeli tablet or not, Izo trina ibonile somehow. Jongo ba naati sa senza show gusi siya zboni zintu. Singe na mafo una baza albetu besa askagabi of age. Gusi singa ba na mafo una. Kota besa zi manga eze nzege mshabeni. Sige ingane. Si sengo fa simba. What perplexes me and breaks my heart even more is that people with children are partaking in such acts. Besa tumutang na daba. Ang pile li mundu. Shop. Let's say you don't care about other people and what other people think about you. That's good for you, darling. That's good for you, baby. Oh, that's good for you, baby. Don't you care about what you think of yourself? Yes, Tandanji. Rhetorical question. You've lost your soul. You've sold your soul. There's a young lady who shared her porter potty experience on social media. And mind you, she's not one of us. 
Undlebe zikani langa. Jongo bangi chela njogu tindo ya bule. She said she was an air hostess, earning a great living, had a loving and faithful boyfriend, and then one slim on a day, she bumped into this yummy man on the airplane. They started flirting, and they were vibing with each other, so they decided to exchange numbers. They stayed in contact for a few days until the guy eventually invited her to L.A. They went shopping. They were fine dining. She said, my goodness, what an experience. I never thought I'd ever be able to experience such glory, such luxury. So it became a thing. He'd take her to different countries, take her shopping, have her dining and devouring the finest cuisines and delicacies until one slimana day he took her to Dubai. Asambein! Sia Dubai! 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 She says he was such a gentleman. He took his time with her. He never touched her. Never tried to kiss her. Never tried to get in her pants. And she was like, my goodness, I found the one. Hey, hey! unendo sis. She's completely forgotten about her decent, loving, faithful man. All of a Sunday, usehlanyiswa ile mali yalomjita. Usekhaliswa ile sineke salomjita. Angamazi. Because they barely knew each other. She said they hardly ever spoke. It was just shopping, eating, exploring. And so when they finally got to Dubai, she decided to take initiative. She leaned in for a kiss. What's on the piece? Hey, Bo. When's that done? Chin. Who do you think you are? What do you think you're doing? I don't know you. You don't deserve me. Why on earth would I even touch you when I barely know you? Why on earth would I kiss a woman I don't respect? One who doesn't even respect herself. She's been out and about with a man she barely even knows. And now here she is making the first move on a man. You're not my type. I don't go for women like you. Women like you who have the audacity to leave their loving partners at home and country hop with men they don't know. What do you take me for? I love myself. You deserve the dirty old men waiting for you in the next room. I mean... Next, he said, get ready. They're waiting for you. I'll fetch you in 30 minutes. Hi, kubona lobo bumnyama. Kuyona leo confusion. Emba kwa leo pokas. She's getting dressed. She's getting ready. Heels on. Jewelry on. She's trying to look as fancy as possible. Zamuguti, you know. As oh, As we say, let's ask me lo sake. Let's ask di manana sake. Es tesa tato ili apokas. Nangu oge se kwa kwa sa. Ukoba matol. Nenya uzuk siningo. Nama koks. Sebi yam tat taking her to the next room with the dirty old men waiting for her. As soon as she entered, the pervs were salivating, just waiting to sink their claws and teeth into her, just waiting to satisfy their sick, dark desires. She had no idea what awaited her. As she looked around the room, there were 30 other young women awaiting their fate. They looked nervous. They looked scared. And she was like, I've got this. I'm a savage. Oh, okay. <laughs> Next thing, what's our way now? What's that? Come to us. One of these dirty old men decided to nominate her to go first. He whispered into her ear, Are you ready? And she was like, Sure. He pulled down his pants and he began to defecate. He began to take a shit. Ithe kundini la dete la u dete lo tufi. 
while everybody in that room watched. Gobani, they no longer have souls. Next thing, what's up? Me? Ipagete el kwele amakaka. What's up, Isla? He shat into a bucket and then gave it to her and gave her a spoon and said, Isla, eat. Enjoy. She began to eat. Yeah, he posa yama posa. Yeah, he ghost yama ghost. She ate until she started gagging. And he was like, don't you dare. And she had to force herself not to throw up and she continued to eat. He watched on. He was so pleased. The more she ate, the more pleasure he got. Next he said, Zimbozengalo, fukam lomen, and gobble my shite. Man, she did just that. <laughs> I'm a chimba. I'm a kaka. This fine young lady with a decent, respectable job devoured feces, a grown man's feces, while her loving, faithful, good man was waiting for her at home. Because she was so overwhelmed by the smell and the amount of feces in that bucket, she began to vomit. Oh, what kind of sap a sap? The old pervert said, Hey, Ngang Logota, Ngang Linga, eat it, lick it up. You're gonna eat each and every crumb of my shite and your vomit, manj. She got on her knees expeditiously and she began to. Sweep the feces and vomit off the floor with her tongue, with her mouth, with her hands, while everybody watched. Next, every disgusting man in that room began to defecate in a bucket and make every other girl do the same thing that she had done. Yeah, let's call her Vulinjela. Starring on its end. Because oh my goodness, I'm eating shit. But you got yourself in this position. And they were told. If you can't take the heat, then get the out the kitchen. If you can't do this, then go. Get out of here. We don't force you. This is the life you wanted to live. You want to live a lavish life without working hard for it? There's a price to pay. There's nothing for Mahalo, dear. Did you think what you were special? What you lame shabby and wound zima ganje um shabba um shabba gangaga? Alan do be seven some weak handler. Go in anje. Guzo balul. And if you can't take him common in bandela, get out. Abuwa! They refused to leave. Why? Because a kanda would do money securing the bag. Hi, bash. But I'll get a spoon. But I'll get a spoon. Bash, I'm a simba band. Bash, I'll get a gun. I'm a band. Bash, I'm a gun. I'm a fairy. Yes, I just, I can't. Like, I. Whether you've started or not, if you struggle to finish and if you vomit and you refuse or you struggle to lick up that vomit, get out. You get nothing. You go home empty handed and on top of that, you buy your own ticket back home. Did you think they were going to pay for it? We don't owe you anything. You didn't fulfill our wishes, our desires, our fetishes. Therefore, we don't owe you shite. Because you couldn't devour our shite. We get it. If you don't get it, forget about it. <laughs> Next activity, Bashishiliza Ngemi Didi. 
nange zisu panzi njenge zinyoka nyoka njenge zinyoka nyoka njenge zinyoka nyoka uyacabanga uyicela kanje umuhle kangaka uyintombi yakwenu ephelele ingashoti ngalutho shishiliza phansi ngendunu ngesisu usu uphenduka isilwane ke manje wenzani khothana namaqaqa they use the feces as lubricant to slide across the floor in general no and as they slide across the floor using these feces as lubricant they lick them off the ground agumandi oh shit that's all i can see mm. ah, it's a mora it's a mora it's a party and it goes on and on for days ngicela umbuzo ukuthi la bantu badla amaqaka bashishiliza phezu kwamachimba bakhotha uthuvi formalin a lousy 40k a mere 40k into ngai sebenzela agcina isidima sakhe an amount that other people make in their sleep these women sacrifice their souls for another one shared how she was a student who just happened to meet a scrumptious wealthy man one sleep on a day at the club guess what this man did he lured her in by being a gentleman by being patient with her he knew ukuthi she had spotted him and so he targeted her and every weekend they would meet at that particular club he didn't rush to get her number no he took his time so she could get comfortable so she would eventually be like ibo kanti wenze njani manje ngicela nini namba when are you taking me out on a date in the dumbest until one slim on a day he did so they exchanged numbers they started meeting for breakfast lunch dinner shopping sprees and eventually tom 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 i a call like move yadlali move ka tla tla tlang of course of course what's that somebody said to buy baby girl drop everything i'll take care of you and she was like what ya funda and he was like la funda zokusiza ngani wena ungatholi imali yamahala umuhle kangaka usexy kangaka let's go you'll live your best life for free you don't even have to work hard for it you don't even have to attain a degree and she said i'd bet forgetting what it is always a catch they went to dubai they continued living a beautiful life again shopping sprees the finest cuisines and delicacies ubona umhlaba uphila kangcono kunabantu abadala kunaye twice her age getting to explore places people don't even know exist the thrill was this was special how they got to dubai they got to dubai they eventually did the deed and she was like how kumna dibo I could live like this. Gandagaz wuti, we am tambis. This is just the intro. This is just the pilot. Gashe gash. Yes, it's unam. The next morning, she wakes up to a room full of 20 other men. 20. So that makes 21 men within her vicinity. We have bugu ya tug. What khona nir? Kwenza gandoni, what's cooking oil? Man says Zia shalam sanj Did you really think it was worth it to drop your degree drop out of university and move to a foreign country with a man you barely even know Did you really think you were going to live your best life Mahala Emhlabeni siphila kona Who do you think you are Sweetheart they may have told you you're special but ni ngwaba Esathukile setetezela kunjalo hayi. Zash. Bamfuka. Bamfuka. They had the greasiest, the nastiest, the dirtiest shit. Na lo guy. That time we am pimsela, we am shy. Hlaba ngempama. Hlaba ngempama, violating her in every way you could possibly think of. Umdabula umdidi. We am hlaba, we am hlikizwe, we am hlepneza. Hey, one petula wa upetula petu kelo. What's I am not prepared? 
angakwethu phela naba ba forwards balambile maba phakelwe yo train balandelana bashintshana ngaye at times you'd have three at a time babies fakwa kuyo yonke imbobo ngayicabanga hayi bayitika bayitika ngogelo ukuthi ukhathele ukuthi ulambile ukuthi kuphlungu ukuthi udumbile aba nomsebenzi uzokhokhelwa nje angithi wena ufuna ukuphila your best life khokha ke phela hayi kinde ngakhokhelwa hayi bo they babster until she can feel a thing they babster until she was numb but it's got to pay lessons don't just get it the show has just begun rex woof woof nangu rex a dog was about to sleep with a human being but you don't know so when do not so what do not so nangu mpel fuck rex with the dolos rex a dog no mount of pilayo umuntu esifazane igugu lomhlaba wathi kurex kwanatshwa wonke umuntu unabile endlini suthi ukelo ha udumbe into ngazi uyibona uyidumbe akapheli kusakho nama rounds alandelayo hayi bo cabe ngani wena angithi yona mpilo oyikhethile lena iyona mpilo ozoyiphila every day ukuze ukhole phela hayi uyashoka ukugela ukuthi hayi ngiphila le hombilo nje enda ngamahloni ngayo because ekugcineni i have a million in my bank account and you broke girls are busy judging me a million ifethu uchoma nge million ifethu he has a million sinde ncane kanjani he has a million sinde ncane kanjani and that's exactly what blows my mind that's what has me flabbergasted ukuthi abantu bakuchoma ngo 40k 50k a million a meter what the hell is that ilutho leyo that's nothing you're going to sacrifice your soul for that malphela lelo million you need to go back you need to top up so that's the life you're going to live until your very last breath eventually they're going to get tired of you you're going to grow old they want young sexy women nature's going to take its course everybody's going to grow old nobody's immune to that you're going to grow old what's going to happen then none of these men are going to marry you none of them take you seriously kubona uyisihlama and then angempela ukusihlama ngoba unalutho ethi wena kodwa unesibindi you have the audacity you have the gall you have the gumption yokuyishaya isithuba uthi ungcono kunomuntu ophandayo ungcono kunomuntu ozithuthukisayo ngemfundo ungcono kunomuntu ozifisela okungcono meanwhile wena in every way possible ususikhombisa ukuthi awuzithandi awuzihloniphi uzibona uyinto nje ulala nezinja fethu ulala nelwane uyagakelwa ulala namadoda ahlukahlukene bese uyayicela bese uyachoma phezu kwalo kuchoma ngemitha ilutho hayi hayi ah khona khona mm 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 there's no way what happens in dubai when you take these girls there Look, when we take the girl in Dubai, we go like to have just fun, you know, to entertain people. Come on, sir, you're not telling the truth, man. In uh, Dubai, uh, it goes down. When the when the slay queens go to Dubai, what happens? Yeah, like that's what I'm saying. It's part of the game. Yeah, yeah but, but what, what happens? But what happens to them? What? No. Tell us the stories. No, no, that's what I'm saying. Man, I'll tell you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Some of them are forced to give camels blowjobs. Camels. Oh. Some of them get crapped on in the face, in the stomach. <laughs> yeah. They're forced to have all types of crazy, wild sex with different people yeah. the and truth. they get paid for that yeah, it not only happens in the middle east dubai but sometimes when they go to the seychelles as well that's what goes down yeah. it's just sodomy that's man that's all it is we we don't yeah. force them you understand yeah yeah that's why they choose you understand i don't want people tomorrow to come to say so you, okay look you took the girl in dubai you took the girl so in you, the you, usa you, you've shot on someone why what do you mean i'm saying like take Are a shit taking a crap on somebody's someone. face yeah why not <laughs> those things happen oh, have you done that those oh. things happen but have you done that <laughs> look 
I can say I don't need those things happen. You've done you it. <laughs> so you've done that. Look, 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 look where Joe is taking me down. But why would you, you do that? Like, why, why would you do that? Man, we we want to have it, a... Hold on, hold on. Is it sex or is it to dehumanize? No, 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 no. We want to have a fun. What, what can we do? <laughs> Where's the fun? And you're not busy. Oh, but it's the norm. I see again who glows part. Stop making such a big deal out of it. Because it's really nothing. This has been happening. This shall continue to happen. And when I, if you want to slave around, and if you don't want to capitalize on your beauty, then so be it. But let us be. And I'm all for live and let live. We shouldn't lead each other astray. I need to slay the city, my spoon bag. See, they spoon boo. Sing a slogan, it's funny, Jane is in Snamatelan. Got a man to must be paid a be pambuga. Sits here, Babonis, to us no more. Lapo, there are so many ways of making money. So many that do not require you to undermine your dignity, that don't even require you to slave around and work your fingers to the bone. It's 2022, Bafere. It's 2022. Careers that didn't exist during our parents' time exist now. Careers that didn't exist two years ago exist now. Careers that ensure that you stack that paper. Money-making avenues that ensure that you accumulate generational wealth. But no. Ningameluk vilap. Ningameluk saduza. Nize neke. Because oh, nothing. Do you know how much money you could make? Look, seven is a don't you? A talent, figure Everybody is gifted, everybody is talented, everybody is multifaceted. That's the dope thing about life. That's the dope thing about Uguba Wena, Uguba Munt. Oh, now you're Jane Day Otto, Eti Wena, or Italian Day Lord Maningi. You just have to find them and nurture them. Tabanga into Opiwe, a higher power, Ugu Tui Sevens, is Uguzi Gwenza Limal. Opiwe. That you didn't have to go to school for. All you need to do is just use it. And you'll make big bank. But I'm funny. Na lap. Ne skole ni as vila pela. Nham ben la lelo khobo. Nham ben la lela ize fuleki. You go around listening to miserable people. Who project their failures unto you. Telling you with your degree is just a piece of paper. Wa wai bon ableont. Yes, the unemployment rate may be sky high. And you may not get a job with your prestigious degree. But that qualification of yours guarantees Wuti Wena you will forever be the chosen one. Mag Velituba Kubuwa wena kal. Kuketwa wena kal. Uluelwa wena kal. Opportunities present themselves to you when you have a qualification. In King Abanda Bafunu Papama. And people have gotten so comfortable with poverty. People have gotten so comfortable with struggling. People have accepted what's in our... You know, we're the bottom of the barrel, miss. Things never work out for us. The system wasn't built for us. We're victims. Oh, granted. We've been swept under the rug with our talents, with our gifts with our qualifications, with our skills, with our knowledge, and all the great things we have to offer the world. But we are vogui tati. We are vogui tati. Ube wash. Ama tuba kwa lumshaba wonke, musuk dekaeza. Uti laika ya koluto. Nga pandle? Nga pandle? Onto na fuguza ganga cross night. Sacrifice your sleep, your social life. Quality time with those you love. And all the good things that matter to you. And then you're comfortable with that. 
And when we share information on how to better yourself and how to secure the bag with that degree of yours, you don't want to take initiative. I don't forget Pela. Tolu Guti Pela. Ienda wene Guti. Get off your bum. Unyaga zoom kombi so to siras na lendo mzok fag. Ngoba veli ipepunan. Ipepa. A piece of paper. O guaz in vessel gutsunga fan and mutong and I. Nya vuma. Nya zvumela nina liso sim. Listen to nasini beat. And then you start hating on other people who have the same qualifications as yours. Got them up papi moyen. Nitinjani, and you begin to question their lives and their lifestyles. Nitch and Wutina Bahambi Beta Makaka, Gandita, Bapape, Banyagaza. But I will not let my background pin me to the ground. I will not let the unfortunate state that my country is currently in cripple me. I don't work this hard to sit at home. Jigen Elanga, Gikitagan Abatagat. I got the betty girl pale as so fan, my big born and get slang and you can get spoiled. Vugan. Let's say I you call get him sebenzi at all. Ne? Or you don't want a job. You don't want to be employed by someone who doesn't even have a qualification. And you see, that's what you say. That's what these people say. That fools are that fools are what I'm a cash rabbin to me and I'm a qualification. Hey, hey, hey. But that's what it's in. Gushu sa, mung and a loot. Now, umla lel. Tunusu zenez, embaux sebenza and simag. Ooh. Let's say you don't want to get hired. You want to be your own boss. Now, Kona, we've been saying there's so many ways of making money. Yes, it's not easy. Nothing worth having comes easy. Attaining a qualification isn't easy. Starting a business isn't easy. Creating multiple streams of income in order to accumulate generational wealth isn't easy. If it were, everybody would be doing it. That's why there are people who opt for the easier way. That's why there are people who opt to make a quick buck. But when, you know for a fact, Wuti, nobody can take that away from you. It's yours. It belongs to you. That degree, that diploma, that certificate, and you acquired the epistemological skills and knowledge that nobody could ever take away from you. You will have them until your very, psh, not even until your very last breath. Beyond your grave, even. Uzobunyisa. In the afterlife. Uzobunyisa. Soze. Wafana no mundo ngenzangi zinto zenzile wena. Zobu itutugisa. Sobe. Numa benga tin shem. Being an entrepreneur isn't glamorous, but it's doable. Yes, you will have highs and lows. You will have gains and losses. But the skills you've acquired, the knowledge you've acquired during that journey will give you the strength to get back up on your feet and prosper. And this also applies to people who don't have any kind of qualification, who are just like, no, I don't need it. I want to be an entrepreneur. It's doable. And Patsy, if you have some sort of qualification, ha. Huh? You will always be the cream of the crop. Because while everybody else is rooting for being streetwise, 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 you may be book smart or book wise, but I am street smart and nothing beats that. Well, guess what? You can be book wise and street smart at the same damn time. The streetwise one or the streetwise and book wise one. Hmm? 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 There will forever be levels. Trust and believe that. Don't ever let anybody successfully diminish your achievements. It's a huge achievement to a qualification. It's a huge achievement to be a successful business person. It's a huge achievement. So Nanin <laughs> 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 <
siyafana nkhuluma nabantu bakithi ngabantu abansundu abantu abampisho lo siyafana kodwa siyayenza iminyakazo uhlulwa yini wena and yes our prayers don't get answered at the same time and idlozi yalisigidele ngokufana kodwa umuntu nomuntu u guaranteed ikusasa eliqhakazile it's all about the choices you make ukuthi izoqhakaza nini ikusasa lapho kukwena kusedlozini kukunkulunkulu kodwa ekugcineni akusho ukuthi deqeza ngobana kubona ukuthi hayi bo nabo sibani bani bethuthuka before mina kodwa siyalingana kodwa sasifunda indawo neyodwa kodwa siphumela ukushina elilodwa siya compare manje siya compete manje sumthakathi i say all this to say sonke bafethu we are destined for greatness all of us have potential all of us are talented all of us are gifted all of us have a bright future ahead of us every single human being on this earth has a purpose every creature on this earth has a purpose you weren't brought into this world to be a bum ukube ipara ukube iferanja ukuba umminenhle ukuba umthakathi ukuba umonase uzogoqwa izandla uzodla amakaka ulana to shake things up uzokhombisa ikhono lakho ukusebenzisa ubuhle bakho ngendlela enhle Hayi zoticelela isithunzi sakho nesomndeni wakho phansi. Hayi mina ngiyajaba. Mina ngiyajaba mina abantu bakithi mabenza kanje. Inkinga ke nje futhi esinayo isifo esiyitika ngathi hayi umona. Hayi umona hayi. Khuleka. Abantu bakithi ma people ah. Bazozama ngayo yonke indlela to find cracks. Empilweni zabanye abantu abazama ngayo yonke indlela uphila impilo eqondile. They will try by all means to belittle big moves, diminish achievements, spew hatred, spread negativity. Ingobo nje masofana. Bafuna sibe impuphe sonke. Angivuma. Angivuma. Back to these women. What do these two women have in common? They are both young beautiful ladies. Both have a promising future. One is studying the other is working one has a loving faithful partner the other has the potential to get that for herself instead of being degraded disrespected and disregarded by these men and ultimately both of them like nice things njengathi sonke sonke seyithanda izinto ezinhle sonke seyithanda izinto ezimnandi sonke siyafuna ukukhazi khazi but at the end of the day buya setshenzelwa there's always a price to pay be it slaving around be it using your brain and exploring different avenues of making money be it being creative innovative using your talents and gifts or sacrificing your soul because ultimately these things aren't just fetishes <laughs> don't let them fool you these aren't just fetishes it's way deeper than that and that's why ukhluzeka komqondo akuve kubalekile ezinye izinto nje futhi uyithola esikoleni kuphela nowhere else abantu abancwadile can peep ezinye izinto zingakaqala ngisho kuqala abona ukuthi mm khona ukushaya amanzi la and i'm not about to partake in such kube khona ke nabantu abaphiweke thotha kancwadile kodwa uphiwe uhla kanipele nje and uyezwa egazini uyezwa imphefumulweni ukuthi ah no they trust themselves they trust their guts they respect themselves and they love themselves and they're just like uh-uh may not be educated i may not hold a qualification many may view me as nothing but uh-uh i will hustle and i will fight until i attain what i want to attain what i deserve the odds may be stacked against me but i refuse to let them paralyze me i refuse to subject myself to such never days because lendo ihamba nemi mo ya these things are spiritual guys so spiritual so dark so evil we are says gwagwa osibutha umhla ukaqakelwa we are lazi badi umshophi obuthayo mhla uyigcoba ngamasimba mhla ubhukuda othuvini esanguna phakade do you have any idea how many sexually transmitted demons you contract through these acts nihambe nibijoza bakho khobo tikoloshe 
in the way, around you, within you. Nibuta ama boys. Nibuti inyoga ama kundwane ama koto. Yo, oh. Ikupu. Inyoni. Eba feta nazi. Anazi. Abanye bayazi, they just don't care. Umuntu se ikobo londo. People have become hollow, soulless. Therefore, abasana ndaba na luto. Hmm. Waze kwa pshungu, waze kwa mungu, waze kwa tumaza. Akage kumundi zindoza kenga hambi gashi. Ete nyuge kakelwa, etanyelwa. Bese zoi kaka, zoi manga, zizi ndoza kenga hambi gashi. Ene stina. No metu ya puma gleo ndu se kala mapizni saake. Vele kuti saka. Etu za muku fonda, vele kube mnyame pisuwe nbengao. Etu za muku zutugi isa nge njeleza fluga flugene. Kushabalal, yonki mzamu. Fane njenu kutela manzi mklanwe dada. Etu se tolu tando, luange mbela. Ndota yako ni veli mnuyalo wa masimba. Totu nuwanga mnange nuke lo. Ute fa, fa, iti yo. Isha nao. Koti ndota yako ni veli mnuyalo wa masimbi, veli mnuyalo wa bola. Iveli boni skumba senyoga meik bona lapi skumba sako si pshelelez. Botoro, hani. Ngoban, ukete, ufumbete. Ubu mnyama, there's a dark cloud hovering over you. You've collected every demon you could possibly think of. Some you don't even know exist. They walk with you. They live with you. They live through you. They live within you. And I saw from Luton how is it not a father must go take the time Gang layers in doors and that in your teens and twenties Get to your thirties and forties in Billy Sia Shangan So to your job will I have to Pants Oh to sabote to her We are nyanisa Nestina Ngolile And then if you're fortunate enough We tole lingo siam An unsuspecting loving man who knows what he wants he commits to you. You're even fortunate and blessed enough for him to marry you. Because that too is a beautiful thing. Don't let anybody feed you poison. Marriage is beautiful. It's a huge blessing. And it is an achievement. These bitter women and boys, they'll try to convince you otherwise. It's a huge achievement. It's sacred. It builds. The problem is people don't understand what marriage is what it means, and the fruits that it bears. Some do know, actually most do know, but because they know what's each child. What are the chances that someone will love me enough? There's no way anybody would commit to me and be faithful to me and loyal to me and loving towards me. Men are trash. They try to convince themselves because nobody's looking in my direction. Nobody sees me in that light. I made so many wrong decisions in the past to the point where I'm undesirable. So now I'm bitter. I'm miserable. So let me make the other girlies feel the same way I feel about myself. Let me make it seem as though marriage isn't a damn thing. Let me make it seem as though it isn't an accomplishment. It isn't a blessing. It's a trap. It's hell. Meanwhile, nobody's ever even proposed to me. <laughs> but yeah, an unsuspecting, loving, faithful man decides to marry a quote-unquote slay queen. Not knowing what this girl was subjecting herself to. Or maybe just knowing bits and pieces of it. Because she'll open up here and there, but she won't share everything because, ah, Shazil Gaga. Usazum Shaki says the Uncle Amasazan. No, it's in this Kelly Eccles focus than Ag. In Quaina, I boo. Quick, quick, quick. Everything goes downhill. I know a baddie and slay queen of note who recently got married, and I was so happy for her. Still am. But what's currently happening to her husband shows, Uguza. She didn't get cleansed. And unfortunately, and I don't wish this upon anybody, but this is just the reality of it. Unfortunately, 
things will continue to go downhill within that marriage because they're now living with Otigoloshi. They're now living with Iluan Zobumnyama. And because of their sacred union, they've become one. So what the woman had, she's given to the man. Ama boys, Otigoloshi, ne nyoga, na ma koko, na ma fodu, ne gupu, go on ke logo pizi, ak uge tu ke not only are these digoloshes sleeping with her, they're sleeping with him too. They said, you want to take our wife? I bet you're now going to be our new biatch. And if you bring children into this world, guess what? So and until Mugel is honest with herself and she does the right thing, in the meantime, be sure to binge watch all my previous videos.